And new tonight, California leads the country with the most fatal train collisions involving pedestrians. Here in San Diego, the most recent incident happening just two days ago when a 17 year old boy was killed in Sereno Valley when he was struck by an Amtrak. Our Juliet Vara takes a look at some of the reasons behind these preventable tragedies. Tragedy on the tracks in San Diego County is real and preventable. January 11th, 2024, Sereno Valley was the scene of a fatal train collision. Four days later, it was Carlsbad. February 29th, Vista. Mid-April, Old Town. All fatalities. Most recently, last Friday in Sereno Valley, a 17-year-old boy riding his bike was hit and killed by an Amtrak train. So far this year, there have been about 12 train collisions involving pedestrians in the county. Last year, California saw 38 deaths, more than any other state in the U.S. People driving around the gates, people walking around the gates, biking around the gates, everything you can think of that we, you know, we see it here in the California. Nancy Sheehan McCullough with California Operation Lifesaver works hard educating the public about track safety. Our incidents are at crossings where there's gates and lights and signals. They think they can beat a train. They don't want to wait. We're distracted, hurried society, and we think we can just go. Nancy says your eyes can deceive you, thinking a train is further away than it is. She warns you it's an optical illusion. People think that they can beat it. And they and they can't. It's not only dangerous to go around gates and be on the tracks, it's also illegal. Big one is having the headphones on and they can't hear and they think they're going to hear the train and the train's going to be loud. Well, it's not true. The trains are quieter than they've ever been. They're faster than they've ever been and people will not hear it. By the time an engineer sees a person or a vehicle on the tracks, it's almost always too late. Nancy says always remember this, see tracks Think Train. Juliet Vara, Fox 5 News.